Today I'm going to be making an auxiliary handle for my crosscut saw. If you're not sure what that means, it's uh, basically a secondary handle that you attach to your saw. It just adds more stability and comfort. It's just more ergonomic. And uh, after uploading my last video, some of you suggested that I make one. And all the uh, auxiliary handles I've seen on crosscut saws have all been vertical. But uh, last night I was rummaging through all my scrap parts and odds and ends. I got quite a few bins full of them. I found this piece here and it's uh, an I-beam clamp and it screws it's got a threaded bolt here that screws tight and it's got a threaded hole here. The only problem with this is this is horizontal. I want something vertical. So I'm going to see what I can come up with this today. Um, found this bolt, 7 inches long, threads perfectly into this piece here. Uh, found some of this hardwood and I took my mini splitter and a maul and broke off a chunk of wood for my handle. This is going to go over top of this threaded bolt. So I drilled a hole through it last night and I don't have a drill press or anything like that so when I came out the other end you can see it's quite crooked. So I tried it again. A bit more successful the next time and I got this handle. So today what I'm going to do is recess this head I just don't like it sticking out the top like that, it's just mainly for looks. Uh, round off the handle, shape the handle, make a collar for this to make it stronger, put linseed oil on it because this wood is really dry, and I want to take a tap and die set and possibly uh, make a hole, drill a hole vertically in this, so I have a uh, both horizontal and a vertical auxiliary handle. So we'll see how that works out. So I'm ready to recess this hole. You can see my fancy drill bit made from duct tape. This will hopefully keep me from going too deep. Thank <laughs> you. 
So I've done quite a bit of sanding on it. I put a little bit of a swell on the end here, shined up that uh, collar. So I think I'm going to try to do a bit of a color match for that and then put some linseed oil on it. So here's the finished handle, and the way this works is you put that over there, tighten up this bolt, and it clamps it against a blade. Just give it a good tighten, and there's your extra handle. I have it threaded on the sides as well, so I have a few different options. 